George's Memorial. If you go out here, this is the pool at the Cosmopolitan. actually look a little bigger than the ones that were uh, down over there. Yes, very open in the back. 
Now the difference here is uh, you get the nice cabana, keep your loungers, sofa inside. Those ones over there, you have your loungers that are in the water. Uh, let's come around here. Oh wow, it's opened up to the back. I want to see that. Oh, that's the actual. These three feel really uh, open and airy. Uh, down below on the back side there was a, a restaurant as you can see. But all who have fans, that's nice, that's nice. You have another pool uh, on the first level down here. That's where you uh, enter from the elevator. You got the Boulevard Tower elevator right there, the signage there, and that's where they let you in. Now back where the elevator was, and I said uh, I'll be over there and head back that way because I don't want everybody to get under a mistake in it. I'm uh, taking these stairs and there, so you have somebody that's in a party that uh, you can't take stairs. Uh, yes, you can. This, this is, uh, I think, very well thought out. Some more day beds here. Uh, elevator, right back there. These day beds. An option we were thinking of when we before we booked our cabana over there is we're going to get one of these with one of these day beds that are right here but uh, but then the, the people in our party that have the uh, disabilities they wouldn't be able to take those stairs they'd have to go all the way around on the scooter so we didn't do that some more I like these little open areas According to the map, there is one more elevator. No, no, sorry, no elevator. There is a elevator right there. Should be another pool over here. Oh, yeah, another multi-level area. Okay, so this is not a pool. I've shown just about every square inch of this place. Now, uh, lounging options are all over. But yeah, your cabanas are uh, only the ones that were across the way right over there. And the ones that are down here. You got these beds all over the place, some in the water. Yeah, I was looking around as I was saying that. Did not find the uh, uh, ADA bathrooms, but uh, I'll go see if I can look for those.
day beds are a tiny bit in the water. Almost like floating out there. Boulevard Center Bar. Alright, don't know yet. Oh, lockers over here too. So if you're on an upper level, uh, the second or third level of that, that uh, pool area, come down here. Here's the restroom. Oh, this is where I thought it was all blocked up. Oh, it is. Sort of. I was over there, I saw that yellow rope and I thought it was blocked up. So. Okay. I think that's going to conclude this. Uh, let's do a little more walking just to make sure. No exit there. So, a little leaf about the center of that pool. That might be for kids. They got the little uh, water uh, splurring up right there. <laughs> got a jacuzzi here next to the bar. Uh, let's, go, let's go check out the bar. Over that way, I think, is the, uh, what's it called? The pizza place. Secret Pizza. Zuma, very good. Go down to the next level. Oh, I didn't see that area right there. Nice little lounging area. We are now at the top of the chandelier. The chandelier bar. It's a three-story bar. Yes, Gordon. Good. Go 
that the casino floor. You see there's three levels there. There's an upper level, level two, level uh, in the middle there, it's level one and a half, and then the first level there. Casino, let's find Andre. And I hope you found the uh, pool tour, the boulevard pool tour, uh, useful. I tried to cover everything that I was looking for and I could not find. Because, like I said, I knew we had uh, two people in our party that uh, were in scooters and we could not find out any information about uh, the second level uh, cabanas. Oh, geez, look back over this way. Go back the way I came. Yeah, yeah, uh, the reason I, am, I know where she's at is we are working on uh, session 13 of our Dancing Drums Explosions Challenge. And, uh, Yeah, if you're not familiar with our other channel, it's uh, over 50 slots. And I do not see her. She did not play. Okay. Because there's dancing drum. Alright, I'm going to go check my text and emails and get something to drink. So, uh, a uh, beverage uh, uh, tip. If uh, you're looking for a, uh, a faster drink, you walk around, you look for a server, and then you sit in that area. You see the chairs lean forward? Hold your uh, game if you have to leave to use the restroom or something. Uh, that's how it's done here in Nevada. I, I've been to Florida and that's just like really screwy. People leave money in it and they walk away and they come back and they say, oh, That's my game, I was playing it. So you lean the chair forward like that, everybody understands. So, uh, hopefully that was a good tip. I'm still looking for a server. It's early in the morning, so I, I can understand there's uh, not a lot of uh, traffic. There's not a lot of uh, patrons. There's not going to be a lot of uh, service. So. All right, I'll find a spot in here to sit down and take a break. Oh. Look, I knew I would find her. She's working. <laughs> so, uh, all right, we got ours. We're right near this point where I started the video. We are in cabana number three. And we are looking out here. The glass is a little warm, or a little high, so it feels a little warm right here. It's not much air movement. Uh, but uh, we do have a, uh, a fan. 
and uh, cabanas do come stocked. Not uh, alcohol, but uh, some sodas, uh, water. We're gonna have a cake in there later. Uh, the only kind of weird thing is our uh, loungers are here. Reserve Havana Street. But that I understand because you can't pull the bandits over there and they need to be in the water. So. Alright. We'll keep getting more throughout the day.